Well, it wasn't just Victoria Derby Day today here at Flemington. We also had the barrier draw for Tuesday's Emirates Melbourne Cup. And as with every year, there was much anticipation around who's going to be starting where in the $6.2 million event. Lloyd Williams, he's got six runners in the race and five of them drew barrier 10 or inside. Oh, absolutely fantastic. You know, we're very, very humbled and very proud to be involved in this great event. It's, it's one of the great sporting events of Australia. It's clearly the best race in Australia, one of the greatest races in the world. And to be involved in such a, it's on such a scale is, is fantastic. And your confidence levels, are they higher now having after the barrier draw? Oh, well, they've got to be. You know, his, history shows that the Melbourne Cup can be won from any barrier, but it's very nice to uh, be in the position that, that, that we've got good barriers and, and probably don't have to ride for as much luck as if you're drawn outside. Do you have a pick? No, I don't. Barrier five for Fiorente. Barry, you'd be a happy man. Oh, it's our first choice. I mean, my wife rode her on a serviette and she was praying that we'd get uh, number five and we got what we wanted. So it was a bit um, dicey when the first one to four was drawn and there was only a couple left, but uh, it, it, um, we got the one we wanted. Not the worst barrier, but not the best. I mean, last year we were drawn it and we might as well be in drawn 24 the way we started the race. And we still ran a good race last year. So with 22, it's not, look, it's not ideal, but it's not going to stop us running a big race. You know, he showed some real spark in his second last race at Newbury, but didn't run well in Ireland. But a lot of us didn't run well in that race. So the boys have done a good job, and he loves it here. And if we'd been drawn well, I, we would have been quietly thinking something would have happened, but we haven't drawn well. Yeah, Barrett 24 with Brew, so I suppose we're used to that. Um, yeah, it makes it a little bit more difficult, but so it just depends on luck and running, how they run the race, etc., as to whether you get in. Um, would have been nice to draw a little bit better, but we haven't, and we're going to put up with that. It's going to be James's job now to give it a great ride. I'm happy with the draw, you know, number 11. He can't take any position in the race. Karim Okupoy, he rode him twice this week, you know, and it, it, if he sat like nice and handy in the race, it'll be, it will suit him. Let's face it, uh, it wouldn't dent mine because Shocking drew 21, so you know, we're lucky to have a barrier, we're lucky to be in the race, so we're just going to enjoy the moment. And how's he done since the Cox Plate? Oh, I'm very happy with the way the horse has done, and uh, you know, he's trained on nicely. Get back on track, Victoria, the Spring Racing Carnival. It's time for some real entertainment. Visit springracingcarnival.com.au. You know you want to.